Storm Team 8, your most accurate meteorologist using the most advanced radar. Live Super Doppler HD, keeping you safe under an umbrella of protection. Severe thunderstorm watch has ended, and we should have quiet weather for much of the night. Still a chance of an isolated shower or storm, but the front is pushed on through, and, well, things are settling down out there. 67 right now, 64 of the dew points, so lots of moisture in the air. We're gradually going to uh, take that down, but it's going to take a couple of days to do so. West-northwest winds at 6, and the pressure rising at 29.80. Lots of nice viewer photos once again. Ricky McFarland taking this shot near coming, and uh, lots we can illustrate here of what's going on. We had the hail falling, some big hail, and as that falls along with the rain, it cools the air out ahead of that storm, and then some of that rain-cooled air is moved back up in the updraft, and as it does, since it's already a little cooler than the surrounding air, it doesn't take much to condense the moisture out and make a visible cloud. This is called an inflow cloud or a tail cloud, and it kind of points the way to the updraft. A lot of folks see these hanging down close to the ground and they're calling in funnel cloud, funnel cloud, but in these cases all that is is updraft coming in. There's no actual rotation that's taking place in the cloud. Then we have a rain-free base down here and that's also all updraft. And some of these storms had updrafts uh, on the order of about 100 miles per hour. So now that you've had your weather lesson, it's time to actually do some identification as we move on through our Indianola camera. I'm going to show you the mechanisms here in real time. So watch this area right in here, and you should be actually able to see some of the updraft, the rain-cooled air moving back up into the cloud. There's your little tail cloud going into the updraft. Pretty cool stuff. And then as that moved on through, a little bit more rain downtown Indianola. Most of the heavy hail is just north and northeast of Indianola, so don't get any pictures of that.